This one I thought was really interesting too. This is Firewalker. It's a relaxing foot cure. Yeah, I remember your pouch. But it contains ethnobotanicals botanicals found in tropical rainforests. Yep. And what's interesting is it was featured in O Magazine as one of Oprah's favorite products. So that one's kind of interesting. So, and then on here, it also has new skin on this page that they gave me. So oh, yeah. I have a feeling that the person that had that also had new skin. Probably. Yeah. New skin actually has some really good products um, with their Age Lock Galvanic Spa, which helps can help you look younger than It actually is a very good product. I have tested it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? I have tested it. This one right here, Sunbrush Tanning Formula. You know, we've been waiting on this one. You can see it's still here. You can tan makers of naturopathic sunless tanners and sun products. The key part is this is a, this is naturopathic. Yep. And tanning quality is equal to or better than a salon airbrush tan. And as you will notice, there is no brush in here. Yeah. There's no assistant that comes with it. So my guess is this little towel that's in there. That's it. Mm -hmm. That's why she will put it. So it hasn't been touched. Everything else has been touched. You can see, see, it's not touched. Right. This isn't touched. Well, the really girly stuff has not been touched. Everything yeah. else people have told. This one right here, I thought was kind of interesting. This one says Carrie 2. This is called brooklet.etsy.com. And if you look at that. What's unique is she's a graphic artist, and so she you can see she did, does fashion styles and things like that. But yeah. my guess is she would probably dress you up and make you look like a doll, too. Yeah, that would be my idea. Mm -hmm. And this one says Carrie 2, which my guess is Carrie 2 from Sex and the City. Yeah. Maybe. Does that look like it's supposed to be? Yeah, Carrie that looks like it would be on one of them. Mm-hmm. So, that was... Same physical structure as right. B, yeah. so wonder which one. So. Okay, this is a company, Nicole Paxson Cosmetics. This is a bronzer, but what's unique about this is it has an SPF in here. Now, this one says SPF UVA UVB, mm -hmm. which is pretty unique, because a lot of cosmetics will say SPF 15 or 30 or whatever, but there's no UVA UVB or anything like that. Which on there should be, according to the thing we've done about it. I know. So let's see how it opens up. Oh, this is just a nice bronzer. Oh, yeah, it's got your colors. Yeah, they're nice. I can wear it. And see, it's a little pretty compact. This company is called Nicole Paxson Cosmetics. And there were other companies there. Oh, actually, Giovanni. Do we have this? And Jenny B. Oh, you know what? Okay, Giovanni Jeans was there. Actually, I wish I had some here. They're, they're actually gorgeous. Is Giovanni, G I O V A N N I. Unfortunately, they didn't have anything that I could bring to show to you, but from what I remember, they do do custom jeans for you. Custom denims that look very, very nice. This one right here, Jenny B. Clothing. Oh, I wish I had it here with me. I do have um, a couple pieces from them. Um, one is like a little, it's a little black dress. Which is really cute. Yep. And the other one is like a an animal print burnout that's yellow. Oh yeah, I remember that one too. It's a problem is if they get worn, they don't <laughs> things get picked out and they're getting used. Well that's what happened is they've been being used and so now they have to be located. Yeah. I think they're, they end they're up... in transit because part of it is we have multiple locations where we're filming from. And so sometimes when you go to get something done, yeah, it's not but, all always there. But being used is a lot better than being talked about. I think so. See, if it's if it's not there, it's because we've used it. Oh, that's true. And if it's not used, it's very obviously not used. Yeah. It, it, it means there's, you know, we're, it means we're, we're moving down the line towards getting that. That will no longer be here after mm -hmm. today. Yeah, so there's a lot of things that are always coming up. This was from, oh, actually, a greenday.org was there. Hmm, they always need support. But this was for Cinema Cities. Oh, I know what I did. E-T-I-O-I-X, e Hodges Collection. 
How was the other clothing company? They yeah. both have really cute things. Really, really cute. I wish I could show them to you because yeah. I'm definitely thinking. But you have seen her on camera and at events wearing some of this stuff, and basically, like we had to re go retract down the the the, uh, the file, and we couldn't do anything with the drink because then we all drank that as soon as it was got. So, drinks and food and stuff are very hard to keep around. Well, they do a lot of times. If we're lucky, we get the cans back. Yeah, we'll do the wrap ups with them with an empty container. Yeah. yeah, there's time there was no empty container because it, somebody walked off with the bottle and finished drinking it. But there's a lot of, you know, there's a lot of good companies that are out there, but the Marine Corps Veterans Association, they're always a great charity, you know, and they could use your help. So whether you're able to go to the gifting suite, or actually, if you're just watching this, you're probably just curious about what they were doing, but come visit the Marine Corps Veterans Association, or to show your support, you can get, this says pink biker chip, heart of a military woman. Yep. Mm -hmm. Remember that master sergeant I told you about that was retired? Yeah. Mm. Yeah. So, anyway, there's something always good when it comes to gifting this week. So for now, this is not a spring chicken. This is a wrap-up of Cinema City's International Film Festival's 2010 Gifting Suite, celebrating Oscars 2010.